we are going to speak about one of my favorite companies which producing the shisha balls, Big Max. So they produce like a really big amount of balls, but first of all, all their balls made from clay. And they are doing it professionally, so they use pottery wheel and most of their balls made handmade, which is giving like a little bit exclusivity for most of them. I think the forms are made on the, the first forms or the first balls made on the pottery wheel, but afterwards it's doing like most of the balls. So I'm going to speak about my favorite ones and the ones which I don't really like here. We're going to start with like top one balls, which I love from Big Max. It's Big Max in collaboration with Hooligan Roller. They have the two options. The first one is kind of a funnel and the second one is the killer which you can see somewhere on the pictures. Why I like it? That you don't need a lot of tobacco. You can smoke it on the free charcoals because it's giving the heat really really good and it also opens aroma greatly. Next one I'm going to speak about this small alien from Big Max. They have kind of the thin one which is named pizza which you can see here. I've never used it so I wouldn't speak about this one. However, this one is perfect if you want to have a session around 30 45 minutes. We are speaking about the normal smoking, for sure you can smoke this <laughs> bowl for more than an hour, but you would lose a lot of aromatics, uh, you would lose the strength in the end of the session. So yeah, 30 40 minutes, perfect time of session for such kind of the bowls. Small alien works great. I would recommend to use it for something not really strong, however, the Tangier smokes great on it. Yeah, any type of tobacco could be used here. For example, if you know that uh, you can smoke it on funnel, just use this one if you don't if you have a short amount of time. Next two balls, there are two types right now. It's Big Max Edge. They have it killer and they have it funnel. The funnel on the picture. It's really interesting to play with the holes in the center to play around it. So you can work with the temperatures in a little bit different way. I admit it, nice idea. But the killer, it's like on the next level. This beautiful bowl uh, is opening like all the strengths, all the flavors, and it works perfectly. It's like, and the one important thing which I want to say about it, if you look on the edge and on the killer, if you will look here or here, you wouldn't see glaze. That is really important because if you uh, put HMD here, it wouldn't do like this. It would just stand here and you will smoke normally. So it wouldn't run away because if the glaze would be here, it would just run from your bowl, which is pretty bad because uh, you usually have a charcoal in it and you will burn your floor. Next, we are going to the bowls, which I am not big fan of. And we will start with uh, Big Max in collaboration with Dusha, Loki. It's kind of the Turkish type of the bowl, as you see from here. I would also add the picture somewhere here. Honestly, it's nice, but there are two minuses. First, you need to heat it really well. Second, you need a pretty big amount of tobacco to use it. and Last but not least, when you wash it and when you drink it out, for example, if you drink it out like this, you, you take it like this afterwards and the all water squirting out of it, like from the whole thing. And it's because there is a special system here when the syrup from tobacco is going, so it wouldn't go inside your shisha, it will collect somewhere here. But the problem is when you're drying it, it's a little bit hard to take water out of it. So that's a kind of minus of it. There are also two more types of balls. The first one, barrel. Don't really understand such type of balls. Honestly, I really don't like them. I had it, I presented it to one of my friends because uh, he could maybe find a use of it. In my opinion, just like too much tobacco you need for it. Uh, it's not giving any like special abilities of smoking. And honestly, I don't like how it looks. And last but not least, the Big Max. Alf. If you see this ball, uh, it looks like the nose of Alf, of this guy from the, I think, late 80s, 90s show or something like this. Maybe it was already like 2000s. Yeah, uh, it was just a nice ball, nothing really interesting with it. In my opinion, it's kind of the brass of the brawl. So I couldn't say that it's a perfect ball, but if you like Alf, <laughs> maybe you can try it. So that was uh, my small review and my experience uh, using the Big Max ball. If you want to order them, I will save the link on them uh, in the description. And don't forget that now I'm streaming on Twitch, so also subscribe to the Twitch. We are smoking some new flavors there, chatting with you guys. So yeah, don't forget to subscribe. Have a nice day and bye. bye.